Welcome to Flynn Style Live, your neighborhood girl gone global. Today we have the beautiful Jackie Marie all the way here from the ATL. So as you guys know, Christmas is quickly approaching. I know some of you probably have already started shopping for Christmas gifts. Unfortunately, I have not. But the main thing we want to focus on today is holiday desserts. So Jackie is the queen of desserts as far as I'm concerned. We've been sharing food and recipes since we were like this high all the way through college. So today we're going to do, I'll let Jackie tell you what it is that she's doing and what she's preparing for us today. Well, thank you for having me. As always, Camille, you I appreciate you bringing me in. But today I made, I've already pre-made our, this is what I call my World War II cake. Ooh. And what it is, is it is a combination of the two. When you say World War II, okay. it's a German chocolate cake mm -hmm. with a German chocolate ganache filling, which is, uh, ganache has pecans and, and uh, coconut shavings on the inside of it. Okay. And then the top, the icing, is iced with a, a white Russian icing. And how I made the white Russian icing was with white chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's a ganache icing. Oh, wow. But I made it with white chocolate mm -hmm. and Kahlua. My favorite. Yeah, it's so, a Sunday yellow. Yeah. But so what I'm, what I'm going to do to add to this and the beautification of this cake is mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and make another chocolate ganache okay. icing that we're just going to pour over. It's going to kind of drizzle down around it. Oh and then what we're going to do is, and I'm going to, I have some more of the white Russian icing here, and okay. I'm going to pipe on. It's just a little Ooh, decoration. Ooh, really nice. So I'm going to show you how to make the ganache first of all. So I have the chocolate chips. Okay. And we're going to go over here to the stove. All right. right. And I'm going to heat some heavy cream. Okay. And I just want to, I don't want the heavy cream to boil mm -hmm. because you don't want it to start to curl. Gotcha. Okay. So you want to just to get it to a little slight rumbling boil, just heat it to a point where it's getting ready to start boiling. Mm -hmm. So you have to pay attention to it. Okay. So once you get it to where it's getting ready to start boiling, then you're going to take it from the eye and directly pour it over to your chocolate chips. Okay. So you have to be careful because that'll burn too on it. Right. Because okay. you, you have to be careful. You have to watch it. You have to pay attention because your milk will also curl if it comes to too much of a boil. Okay, so that means no Facebook Live, no texting while no. preparing this dish. No. <laughs> Translation. Actually, you can do Facebook Live because I do it all the time. <laughs> like we're doing. Well, I'm a professional. So. <laughs> I do okay. this. All right. So let me get it going. I got the eye. Okay. So. And then once it starts. like Christmas. I know that's my favorite time of the year. I have to admit Christmas is my favorite time of the year. I enjoy, yeah, I enjoy Thanksgiving because we all get together and we cook and you know it's a good time for family and friends mm -hmm. but it's just something about Christmas. I get excited about the lights. Maybe that's my thing is the lights in the stores and just shopping. Well maybe window shopping. I don't have any money. <laughs> But anyway, you know, it's always fun. And then preparing delicious desserts. You know, the main thing um, I enjoy preparing is a peach cobbler. My mother taught me how to make. But like the different, the dessert, like you're talking about this, um, the icing, I'm excited about it because she says the ganache icing. So I've never tried to prepare this. This is totally new for Flynn style. But now that Jackie's teaching me how to prepare it, maybe I'll try to fix it for my family for the holidays. But if I don't, I do have Jackie on speed dial. Absolutely, <laughs> and I can talk you through it. Okay. So, all right, so now our, our milk, our, this is actually, it's not milk, it's actually heavy cream. Our heavy cream is actually starting to warm, but it hasn't started boiling yet. So okay. I'm just stirring it so you can get Okay, now I see what you're saying. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. And then you just don't want it to boil. That's the only thing. So you have to so watch it. So you have it. to watch it. So I have to actually stare at the milk, the cream. I'm sorry. Yes. But don't walk away from it. See, okay, now I've already, I've already see, I get distracted very easily. So because if you turn it on and you away. walk away from it, as quickly as you walk away from it, it'll start boiling on you and it can curl because the milk will curdle really see, fast. That's what she does, what she does, and I do what I do. Yeah. So 
I just watch for a while. Okay, so now okay. it's heated enough. Okay. So you got a nice little, it's getting ready to start. I'm going to step on this side of your jacket just a little yep. bit on my cheek so I can and see. And then we're going to go ahead and turn it off because it's just getting ready to start like a boil. Okay. And then you're going to go ahead and you're going to pour this on top of oh, these okay. chips. Okay. Just that easy, huh? Just that easy. And it actually starts to melt immediately, immediately as soon as you pour the ingredients. Guys, if you could smell this chocolate, it smells so, so let's good. Go like it smells like Christmas. Christmas. Thank you. See. Okay. So you just kind of keep stirring the warm, mm -hmm. and that's just regular canned milk. Mm -hmm. No, this is no, this is heavy cream. Oh, heavy cream. Mm -hmm. So there is a difference. Okay. Heavy cream. Okay. So you take the heavy cream yep. and mix. Okay. Just that simple, huh? Mm -hmm. Just that simple. And you oh, just keep gosh. on, keep on. You got to keep stirring it. Mm -hmm. And it's going to all start to... To melt. And you just kind of use a spatula mm -hmm. and kind of work your way through it. Because mm -hmm. it's still melting. Okay. Now see, guys, Jackie makes this look so simple. But I'm quite sure when I start to try to prepare this for me, I'll, the cell phone will be in this hand and then the spatula will be in the other. And I'm like, eh. Okay. So guys, if you can see this, we're going to zoom in a little bit closer so you can see what Jackie was talking about. And because of the heat of the uh, cream, and it's heavy cream, correct? Mm -hmm. heavy, heavy cream, cream and the chocolate morsels are all just combining together. Right. So now they're starting, you just oh keep gosh. on stirring until it's all... Look at that. And you know what this reminds me of? And I'm a Hallmark Channel junkie as well. So it just reminds you of Hallmark for the holidays. Yeah. <laughs> In the kitchen, cooking desserts, or just having that great cup of hot chocolate on a cold day. And luckily for the first time in a while in Savannah, it's actually cold outside. So, I was so excited November. to get up. Yeah, finally, because the other day it was like, what, 90 degrees? Oh my Who goodness. Who does that? in November, Savannah, Georgia. Come on, you remember, we were kids growing, I was, you know, walking down the street Christmas day. Exactly. With, with a short sleeve sweater on. With a, with a short sleeve sh uh, shirt on. But at least today it's nice and cold outside. So this is something that just smells, reminds me of Christmas. It's warm to your soul and to your spirit. And it just makes you feel good. At least it's making me feel good just smelling it. Right. I'm sorry y'all can't okay. smell it, but we can. So see how that did? You just oh, keep wow. going okay. until it's smooth. You keep into all your morsels. Okay. Because what's going to happen now, mm -hmm. you just let it cool just a little bit. Okay. Just a little. And you don't add any sugar. No sugar. No extra. No nothing. Okay. You just let it cool just a little. Because once you pour it on top of your cake, uh -huh. what's going to happen is it's going to start to harden again. Oh, really? Okay. The chips are. Okay. So Jackie, tell us who taught you how to do all of this cooking. Like I watch you on it was Tuesdays and Thursdays on your mm -hmm. live, and if I miss it, I do go back on and catch up on what you've prepared. Yes. But how did you get started on this cooking journey? Um, actually, I've always my mom was mm -hmm. a big, big cook. Mm -hmm. Um, you know that. Yeah. My mom was a, a excellent cook. I am one of eight kids. Okay. Um, I have seven siblings. And we, um, my mom just cooked. She would just cook every single day. She was a stay-at-home mom. Mm -hmm. So she, when we come home from school, there was always a pot on the stove. Gotcha. Whether it was one, two, three. It was dinner was always ready when we got home from school. Mm -hmm. So actually did not discover my actual passion for cooking mm -hmm. until later years in life. Okay. When um, after getting married and everything and having my own family, I discovered I said, like this okay so from liking it and just remembering the things that i was forced to do right <laughs> growing up hey cut this up hey cut that up yeah. hey do this hey do that uh -huh. i started to implement those things that i was i learned from being forced to do something growing up wow to now that it's turned into an actual passion and i think that's wonderful because children now they i don't think they know anything about cooking at least my daughter is not 
Mine excited about good. learning how to cook. She's like, Mom, we can go out to dinner. So everything is, let's go out, let's go out, let's go out. And I'm like, who's going to pay? Who's going to pay? Who's going to pay? <laughs> yeah. But, you know, that's how kids are. So because I they really... they live in a microwave society. I know. We, I know. It's crazy. But they don't know what it's like to cut up bell peppers and onions and good stuff like that right. to get ready for Thanksgiving and get ready for the holidays, mm -hmm. as well as dessert. And I did teach her how to bake a cake from scratch. Mm -hmm. uh, that's something oh, my excellent. grandmother taught me how to do because, and we had to mix it up by hand. She would mm -hmm. not let me use the, the, the blender. I had to use it by hand. Yep. So here I am with this big bowl and a big spoon, and I'm just getting it, getting it, getting it. And I was like, Grandma, my arm is tired. And you know, older people didn't care about you getting tired. That was no excuse. None, at right. least for Viola Flynn. She didn't play the radio when it came to that. So when, we, when, we learned, when I learned how to mix a cake, everything was by hand. No blenders, no mixing. So it was funny when I was home with my mother and she pulled out the, her mixer. I was like, oh, grandma gonna get you. You're not supposed to use the blender to mix up a cake. But anyway, great childhood memories and great stories. So and now I have multiple mixers. I and bet. Wow. So, all right, so now I can continue to stir this until the, the ganache is nice and smooth. So what okay. I'm gonna do is I'm going to start to pour it over. Look at that. That so I just wanted deliciousness. I just wanted to kind of slide. Oh over my God! The edges. Like as do you see that? And when I tell you, as she's pouring, you can smell the chocolate just blending with the other chocolate already on the cake. We're not going to use it all, but it's going to go over the sides, you guys, and it's going to be a little messy around the plate. That's okay. Messiness is good. <laughs> but we just want to put it. Just make sure we cover the whole top. Okay. So you just pour, and it does its own thing. It's yeah. pattern. It, it doesn't have to create a pattern, I no, should say. No, it doesn't. You know, and some of us are just so particular, like, oh no, the chocolate is not in the right place. With this cake, it does not have to be perfect at all. Just the drizzle. God, the drizzle, Jesus. Anyway. Mm -hmm. But you just want to cover oh, everything. Looks so good. Okay. I did cupcakes uh, about a week ago. Mm -hmm. Because I actually like the World Two Cupcakes because, you know, in honor of, um, I, I use the filling like I use in here. Okay. I use the filling as a, um, you know, a tribute to Veterans Day. Okay. So that looks so yummy. So, so we did it like that. And great. like I said, we don't, it doesn't have to be. So we've done that. Okay. And it's going to, like, See, going down the sides, but you still got the white look around the edge. Look at that. Look. So look. it's going to cool down. Look at all that goodness. And so we have to wait until it cools down before we do anything special and fun? No, no. Um, Because this it actually should because the cake is cool already. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to pipe on. Okay. Now that's something I want to learn how to do. I just learned how to do this. Can you do that? Is it hard to do? Like it looks easy, it's, it's but then really when I tried not. it, I was like, mm. It's really not. Just gonna pipe on a couple of like this. Okay. Look how pretty Jackie makes everything look so easy. Let me just pipe on a couple of them. Okay. And see, you can serve, guys. And when you decorate it, make sure you have your cake, your cake plate, um, pedestal or whatever. Most people, I have this from my grandmother. So this is an antique that we're actually decorating this cake on. So when you have your guests or friends over, make sure you invest in one of these. It's beautiful, mm -hmm. beautiful presentation. So we're doing it like that. Oh, that looks so good. And let's put one in the middle. Okay. Make it a little bigger. Look at that. And so your piping is made of? This is the... Um, white chocolate and Kalor. Okay. Icing. So white chocolate and Kalor. Right. Okay. Who out there loves Kalor like I do? I'm sorry. See? And my friend, you guys can't see Hannah. Hannah's kind of sitting in the background. But she, there's Hannah. <laughs> so she right raised her hand like, yes, I do. I love it. That is so and good. And I'm actually going to make these a little bigger. Just okay. Like just, wanna, just for the beautification of the cake. So it's Kalur and... White chocolate. You'll make the white, white chocolate, chocolate ganache the exact okay. same way okay. that um, I made the chocolate ganache. Okay. And what I do is, I, while I'm mixing, while it's still in, in this creamy form right here, mm -hmm. I add some, um, I add the Kalur to it. 
And I'm gonna wipe a little bit of the drizzle while Jackie, even though I would like to take it with my finger, but I won't yeah. do that today on live. So I'll try to be appropriate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Napkin. So um, you take and you, like I was saying, you take and while it's still in the cream, like it's in the, the liquidy mm -hmm. form, mm -hmm. you add the caloric there. Okay. And then once you let it cool down, okay. you have to. You have to let it cool. Okay. Then once you let it cool, mm -hmm. it'll start to thicken. Okay. So then you'll add your confectionery sugar to it and, oh. a, and uh, use it on a mixer, a blender, or, okay. uh, not a blender, a uh, mixer. Okay. And you're going to whip it. Oh. And that's how you get it, the whip texture. Okay. Now, is there a certain amount of caloric you can use or cannot use? I'm just saying I want to use a little extra. <laughs> you can use a little extra. I, I used about a quarter of a cup of caloric okay. when, when I made this icing. That's the right size amount. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. about a quarter of a cup. I mean, it's enough to give you the flavor. Okay. But you're not going to get the alcohol potency of it, but you will get the flavor. That's delicious. So, yeah. So then, Love it. So, can I, can I, am I allowed to cut yes, this and baby? now we can cut it. How do you guys, what do you think? Well, Tanya Pilcher says that she sees that you're in Savannah and wants to come by and get a slice. <laughs> and well, Tanya, come on by. And Sabrina Fitzgerald says, yes, goodness. Georgia <laughs> May kept everyone fed. Love That's the right. Simmons family. That's right. So, we're, we're, look, we're spilling a little bit. We're got a little spillage That's going okay. on. That's okay. Hold on, I got to just shower. Okay. So we, we can. That's our camera person. You see her finger? <laughs> yeah. We're good. We're so, good. Okay, so we just put the little towel right there. Yeah, let's put it in. Okay. I wiped it where it was dripping. Alrighty. So, so we're gonna cut. We gotta take some pictures of this, you guys, before we cut it. Can we, we get some to. pictures before we cut it? Because if we get some pictures, then I'll cut it, and I'll let so everybody sorry. tell me what they think about it. Yes. So, I wanted to. I do want to say. Um, that, her pass her phone right there, Hannah, please. I do want to say that if anybody would like to follow me, you can follow me on social media and. On Facebook at Jackie Marie Scott. Um, I do a live show every Tuesday and Thursday night uh, at 7:45 between 7:45 and 8 o'clock every Tuesday and Thursday night. Um, I also do um, I have a social media on Instagram. It's Soul in the Bowl 678, and I have a YouTube channel called Get Soul in a Bowl. And if you could please like share subscribe go on there we're trying to build this thing up and mm -hmm. you know we talked about um i've talked to you about this doing my uh, i have a mission that i'm doing where i'm feeding the homeless that's people. right it's so about that yeah mm -hmm. i actually um it was for thanksgiving and christmas and what we're doing is we're raising money and so far we've raised about nine hundred dollars awesome. And um, what we're doing is we're raising money to prepare meals mm -hmm. and care packages for the homeless on Thanksgiving Day okay. and Christmas morning. And what we're doing is we're going out, pre I'm preparing, I've already been purchasing all kinds of stuff. So um, what we'll do is we'll go out to uh, the homeless camps mm -hmm. in the Atlanta area, in the okay. greater Atlanta area. And I will, um, we, we have like care bags that we're, we'll give them a meal and then mm -hmm. we'll give them a care bag. Okay. And, you know, people always ask me, why do you want to do this? Why do you want to do this? Because if you look at, in the Bible, it says, you know, feed the hungry. Right. Clothe the naked. That's so I, I'm, I want to feed the hungry and at some point I want to be able to clothe the naked. If I can help somebody, if I give them a blanket, a jacket, right. some socks, mm -hmm. you know, those are things that I want to be able to do for the people who don't because everybody has a story and that's so important and let people know too jackie how they can contribute to what it is that you're doing if you go on my facebook page i have a link on my facebook page um it's called the soul in a bowl mission um it's to feed the home folks on the bowl mission to feed the homeless you can donate there um and it goes straight through my uh into an account that's set up just for mm -hmm. that situation, for that project, I should say. And um, I, every little mm -hmm. dime helps. I have 5,000 Facebook friends. Mm -hmm. If each of my Facebook friends gave $5, that would make a huge, huge difference. Yes. My goal was actually 5,000. Okay. But to be able to reach, to get as close as I have gotten, right, yeah. has you been, yeah. And I would like it to be an ongoing thing, so. 
the more people give, the more I can do. So did you hear that, everybody? The more you give. And what I want people to understand, I'm glad we're going live as well. What we do costs. It's not for free. Even when we try to give back to the community, even to prepare things, it costs. And even we want to go out and help more people. But we need your help as well. We enjoy the likes. We enjoy the hearts. We enjoy the kisses. But sometimes we need a little more help. We need some funding. So make sure you go to Jackie's page. Help donate to her cause. And I'll be reaching out to you again and letting you know how you can help Flynn Style as well. Both of us have some really, really big projects coming in the year 2019. Absolutely. I'm going to speak that out there already. Absolutely. So we're going to be coming to you for some help. I know you love us. You like us. We see the hearts floating. Uh, Ron is manning the camera. Hannah was manning the camera. And so is Spring, excuse me, <clears throat> behind the camera as well. You can't see them. But anyway, they're reading your comments. So please, 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 when we reach out to you, we would love your help, definitely with Jackie for the holidays. And we're trying to make this go beyond the holidays because people don't only get hungry for Thanksgiving and Christmas, Absolutely. even though we're talking about the holidays now. When the months of January come, it's very difficult for people because January is really a long, long month. So if you can help, I don't care if it's $2, or $200, whatever you can send or what is ever laid on your heart, let's say that. You know, go ahead and make that donation. We would greatly, greatly appreciate it. So today, oh, and follow us on social media. Let them know exactly where they can follow you one more time, Jackie. Okay, um, you can actually follow me on Facebook at Jackie Marie Scott. And I have a Facebook group also on, uh, a Facebook group called Soul in the Bowl. You can get on there as well subscribe come on in join us it's an open group we have a great time on there a lot of my viewers have just become family because they watch they're like everyday watchers so then you can follow me on instagram at soul in a bowl 678 also i have a youtube channel called get soul in a bowl and you well, no, it's not Get Soul in a Bowl. I apologize. It's Soul in a Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> so you can you find me on YouTube as well. So please, if you if if you can, like, share, subscribe. Just I'm inviting people into my family. You invite me into your family, I'm inviting you into mine. So just come on and join us. And I like that. And even though you said, no, it's Get Soul in a Bowl, but no, it's not that. I'm going to speak it to her life that it is. So her get soul in a bowl could potentially be meals that Jackie has in grocery stores around the world. Her meals, if you want to purchase, I'm going to speak that out there. So if somebody wants to sponsor her get a soul in a bowl, we're looking for it soon to be in Kroger's, in Publix, in Fresh Market, in any grocery food store around the world for 2019 for her to start having her soul in a bowl. How would you like to get some of her cake frozen and shipped to you? Or some of her meals, if you're still struggling with trying to prepare them, Jackie can prepare it or her beautiful face will be on the box in your local grocer's freezer. How about that? That sounds like plenty. Just never know. Yeah. So any questions, and I'm gonna take a few questions and see, we do have one person that's on our live feed are there any questions on our feed that we might have missed or any good mornings to everybody? Good morning. Anything? You have several friends who have followed you, just followed you and shared. God, so God. Rebecca South has shared and Sandra McCoy says, looks good. Thank you. Rebecca South also says, hi, I just followed you as well. Doris McCoy says, looks yummy. Thank so you. everybody is really complimentary about what they are seeing and virtually tasting. Good. I love that, guys. And that's so wonderful. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, my name also is Camille Flynn Style Flynn on Facebook. Send me a friend request or follow me, whichever one you would like to do. I'm also on Instagram Live. I am Flynn Style 2014. I'll be doing some live um, commentary Tuesday nights, but I might change it because I don't want it to kind of conflict with Jackie. Jackie comes on on Tuesday night also. I was trying to do Tuesday night at 6.30. And wait, we can see each other. Yeah. That's true. So I don't, I don't want to miss out on her feed also. So I'll keep you posted on what time I'm going to go live. This week, I'm going to talk about relationships. 
love and life like I told you on last week just some things I think people would like to talk about mm -hmm. and chime in on your questions also I'm quite sure Jackie will take some suggestions maybe some things you would like to see her prepare I'm quite sure she would do it and put her own little twist and little umph to it her little southern seaport yes. style to it so Jackie has been such a pleasure having you on Flynn Style Live today and driving all the way from Atlanta y'all she came in so let's cut the cake though before we forget. I want you to see this yumminess. All so right. see, we can cut it now because it's it's not a chance to kind of sit, sit for a minute. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna I'll let you do the it. honor of cutting. I'm gonna cut it here. Ooh, ooh, and ooh. I'm gonna I'm gonna have Tanya slice for her. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry that Ron is gonna uh, eat your cake. I'm sorry, no idea here. who Ron is. Do y'all want me to tell y'all who Ron is? It's Miranda Lumpkin Lotson. Yes. Let me tell you, it's a wonderful thing to have friends to support you here in the city where you you grew up. So it's, oh, look at that. So, at the inside. Oh. It's so nice and moist. That's Tanya's piece. That's Tanya, like, if this is yours, I'm going to eat it. Ron's not going to actually get this, but guys, look at that. Look at that. So I'm gonna Just layers of deliciousness and all of that ganache and that chocolate drizzle. That is mm -hmm. to die for. Mm -hmm. So guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to make you uber jealous because I'm here with Soul in a Bowl today, the superstar. See, I, we grew up together, so I can get her autograph today because in a minute, I'm gonna have to go through her people uh, no, you will and never get in touch with her people to get in contact <laughs> with my people to get in contact with her. But anyway, I have the bat line, but I'm gonna let you know how this tastes. I'm gonna take the first bite. So I wanna make sure, and Hannah, come on in. I want guys, you can see Hannah. You guys kind of shoot Hannah. This is my other baby girl right here, Hello. Hannah. So Hannah's in studio with us. So I'm gonna let Hannah have this. I'm gonna serve my guest first. Yes. So I'll let Hannah get that. Jackie, can I, I have get another piece? Sure, 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 sure. Now, oh God, look mm. at that. What do you think, Hannah? Perfect. <laughs> so She's nice perfect. and so creamy in the tula. Mm. Just the that. perfect ratio. Oh, I'm sorry, I have to put my plate down. I'm sorry, <laughs> hold on. Do, 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 do. Right. And Mariah is coming right in too. Here. Where's Ron? I'm right here. There yeah. she is. And hey guys, oh, this is Mariah. Nice. Y'all see? <laughs> there, Ron. They won't let me have nothing by myself. Yes, they no. no. You guys gotta tell me see? how you like it. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. I have to check for all ten of Jackie's toes. Oh. <laughs> Mm. This is fabulous. I'm glad you Perfect. like it. This. Cheers, my dear. So can you taste the color? Yes. I can yes. taste the color flavor. I think it's, this it's is, I want you to zoom in on me. <laughs> this is mm. simply I can taste it. Did you, you get all of that in my face? I want you to get like <laughs> all of my facial expressions. It's and like the in the absolutely. Fulfilling. What's going on cool? inside of my just, mouth right now with the like this? is the best side of heaven right here in chocolate. Do y'all see? I'm looking at y'all over my glasses. <laughs> like this cake is making me feel sometimes. So do you do you taste the ganache and the filling in the middle? You do. Have you, have you discovered what Can it you is? see that? I didn't know if you could see it in there. It's so good. But anyway, guys, this is Flynn Style Live. We're gonna stay here and eat though, however. Yes. <laughs> but this is Flynn Style Live, your neighborhood girl gone global with the beautiful Jackie Marie and our wonderful guests, Miranda and Hannah. Thanks to Spring and Sika for Thank all that they you. do for me. I love you guys. Thank, Thank you, everyone. Have Bye. a fantabulous Sunday. Bye. Happy Bye. Sunday. Mm. All right. <clears throat>